Cut. <laughs> it was good. I uh, had to say, I, did, I couldn't have holidays the last year because of the virus, and I needed a break. <laughs> I was, uh, it was refreshing holidays. I enjoy with the family. I didn't meet much my friends because I didn't want to, uh, to put myself and my family in risk. Like kind of clean myself from all the disappointment and you know bad things that happened in the last two years and now I'm yeah coming like new I stayed uh, for a month a little bit longer than a month and then plus 10 days here in quarantine it was like 35 days something like this head coach gave, gave me three or four more extra days <laughs> really grateful for that <laughs> I talked to him before and actually no I, I, I put my phone away <laughs> to be honest and stay focus on my family kids and <laughs> all the friends well the first thing he said is uh, he thanked me for staying he that he's happy that he's uh, he's glad that I chose to stay um, and uh, he told me to take it easy take my time because the other players have been training already for two weeks, even a little bit more. So, yeah, he's he's treated me really well, to be honest. Yeah, uh, I feel good. Obviously, not not ready. Uh, I I see the team, a lot of new faces, young players coming up. So it's still you know in the making, the team. Uh, have good feelings. Um, I have to say also the head coach is all the time tell me <laughs> to slow down but uh, well I I want to push myself especially surrounded by all young players <laughs> I don't want to stay behind and yeah that's that's basically what I'm doing try to go one more step one more rep when they ask me how you are yeah I'm I'm fine I want to uh obviously get fit as quick as possible but also, because of uh, all the young players, I want to be kind of a model for them, you know, not to give up or not to stay on the side because, uh, you know, because I'm older or something. I want them to see that I'm, I'm here to play, to train, to, to, to do the, the job. So maybe I can help them in a way. Yeah, well, uh, I think it's, uh, it changed many things. I think when a team continuously win well, we didn't win all games but it's true that in i think in 12 games we didn't lose just one time because we got red card uh so when the when this strike goes on it's not just for one reason i think we did a lot of good things obviously he did a lot of good things um i think the main point is uh it was to stay really on to us that this club is big, even though we are not the, the champion, but Seoul is a big club, it's, it shouldn't be down there, shouldn't be fighting for relegation. And everything started in our minds, individually, and he helped us to remember this, to maybe some players were lack of confidence, were thinking, oh, I don't know what is happening, they, they had questions but not answers, and he came with one clear idea and I think the players understood the way and uh, I think everybody could see it was a different team there's a big point from him organization is really important uh, intensity uh, orga organization intensity uh, confidence um, and vision we saw a lot of these these things that is not has nothing to do with football, with tactics and anything, you know. But these thing, these points were really, really important in order to go up and to be the best as we could in seventh position. We couldn't go higher, but uh, and to show that uh, even the last game against Bohan, we didn't, we were saved already, but we pushed, we 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 fought to win. We didn't stop until the end, and this is a. Uh, this is something that he wanted from us and I think most of the players got, got it.
Well, first, uh, as I said in the, in the first question, he treats us really well, to be honest. He make us made the team clear that we are important in the team. Obviously, as long as we give him back, and I think we he treats us in a different way. We gave him all that we had, Ki, Johan, me. You know, so it was like, okay, we, he give us, we give him, he give us, we give him. So I think we, this was, uh, I think, big big point in order to bring all the team with us. We knew Ki, Johan, me. We, <laughs> we didn't want to to see the team going down, and we saw with his mentality and his line of work, we could save the team, not just save the team, but uh, show something else as it happened. So the way he treated the veterans, he gave us a lot of responsibility. We didn't, we didn't avoid this responsibility. We took it with us. By doing this, I think the other players followed. You know, and I think how this is how you, he organized a large group of people. Well, it doesn't change anything. I still enjoy more in the midfield. I think I can be more, um, more involved in, in more phases of the game. You know, whether it's defender, uh, in defense, in the build-up, creating and, and even though making some points in attack. Or, but uh, he wanted me to play as a defender. I'm, I'm happy to play there. I feel good. I was defender before. It's not something that is new to me, and I know we have good people, good players in the midfield. So I know if he puts me there, maybe someone else, someone, another good player should go out. So I, I totally understand. I'm not, uh, I don't know, not angry or something, uh, <clears throat> because I know I'm more needed behind. I can be more important or I'm more important for him in the defense line. And that's what I tried to do, I, to know what he wants from me and do it. <laughs> First, the, the change in the team in the last games brought me back some um, faith for the future that something could happen, we could stay up again. Uh, the mentality of a head coach, I think, is very important. I, he insists and insists on everything what I said before, to be ambitious, to be, you know, this is a big club. And at the end, the club wanted me here. You know, I, I, it's not, uh, sometimes you go one team or another team, but you don't even know why you, you are there. Even though there, is, there was a crisis because of the virus, now things are different. Negotiations are different. Everything changed. Uh, the club really made a, a big move and a strong move towards keeping me here. So I, yeah, I, I was. I, I, this is something I needed. My contract expired, and I needed to see my the, the club wanting me, and of course the head coach. When these two things happened, and obviously I. I <laughs> like I would like to stay here. It was quite easy to to agree. Mm -hmm. Probably I'm I'm happy to think like that. Uh, I don't know. For now, I have two plus one in my contract. I don't know how long I will play. Maybe I I hope not. But maybe some bad injury happen and I have to finish before, or maybe I can continue longer because I'm uh, physically good. But I like to think that one day I might retire here. It's, it would be it would be like a like a dream. It's really important for you. Guys. Yes, yes, obviously. And I don't want to um, by getting old on old. I I don't want to keep moving from club to club with 34, 35, 36. Especially after spending all these years here, if I can get. Uh, nine years or the option of the year, maybe to 10. Well, finishing, finishing in the same club that you play 10 years or almost 10 years, I would be very happy to finish my football career like that. Well, first I, 
obviously because of language, I, I don't think the communication would be a problem. Uh, lucky for us, our captain Key is also English speaker, so uh, I think he will he will have good help from me and from Key as well, in order for him to adapt quicker. Uh, in terms of uh, football and tactics and positioning, first he he needs to do some self work in order to understand the coach. But uh, again, me and Key will be, you know, watching if he doesn't understand something. Same as we did with with Palo or with any other or any other player, we are always watching if there is some problem, there is some misunderstanding. Some players have difficulties uh, understanding the tactics. We are there, and obviously, with a new, with a new player, we have to do this even more. So, first of all, he needs to be he need to be willing to adapt, obviously. Uh, but we will be there for him all the time he needs. Again, it depends because if you count me as a midfielder or as a defender. Or <laughs> I see good potential. I see that the young players, they have some players, they have good potential. Obviously, they need time. Everything needs time in football, and, and, and sometimes we cannot push too much uh, young players because, like, happen to everyone. You don't know how to maybe handle the pressure. You know, it's difficult. So you you have to uh, treat them nicely. I'm, I'm sure the head coach knows this. Not, not one name comes to my mind, but I see a good potential. All they need is to be awake, to be concentrated. Again, this head coach requires a great intensity, great, great level of concentration. It's not good that I'm saying this, but I think they are lucky to have me and Ki and Johan, these players, on the team. So I think for them it's time to, again, be concentrated, learn, listen, and Maybe one year, two years, or three years, they can become straight up a, a player in the team. Hamun was it was a surprise, to be honest, because um, all of a sudden the new co the new coach came. We didn't have defenders. He wanted you no know, key coming up and down to the defense line. We needed someone to fill this this gap in the defense, and he didn't need much time to understand anything. Obviously, he needs to learn more because he didn't play much. But again, yeah, I see good skills, good mentality, uh, quality and, and great potential. And I felt good playing with him. Not, not a player that I had to take care of all the time and tell him all the time what to do. Uh, which is a good point when, when he's young and I don't need to worry about him. You know, he gives me security. That's, that's a good point, and I know for, for sure that for Key it was the same. He was comfortable playing with him. It's up to him, <laughs> up to his mentality, his mindset, his work. But definitely his, he can be the next, you know, the defense leader of FC Seoul or great big name here. Cool. Yes, yeah, sure. yeah, it's kind of true. <laughs> I don't feel good. You know, I, I feel uh, bad with myself because I, I, know I, I know I wasted my first four years. I try to have like 20 different books that I tried to study by myself. Uh, I signed up for an academy. And after a week, we changed the training time, so I couldn't go anymore. Yeah. And I don't know, somehow I couldn't find the right timing. and. <clears throat> Obviously, Korean is, is a language that you have to focus. Yeah. And every time I tried, after a couple of months, I stopped. I don't know, for whatever reason. And after the four years here, then I had my first baby. Everything got more complicated and suddenly you were like, OK, let's go. But uh, lucky for me, yeah. I have help. <laughs> Hi, Brian. Hi. <laughs> I have great help here. So, but I, I, I have to say, yeah, I feel, I feel bad all these years and not speaking Korean, um, especially because in this club, I, obviously, I know people from a long time, like a driver, like a kidman. 
I make jokes with them, but they are so simple jokes. And I really would like to speak Korean to communicate in a better way with them. He's, it was weird, you know. I, I always thought he would finish here. He would be, I don't know, coach, but he would do something after player for this club. But as I read, I, I don't know anything. I just read on, on, on social network that he wanted to play and you know the club didn't want him as a player fair enough for both sides and well life continues he wants to keep playing he found another another place to do it but definitely it's, it's weird not to see him here <laughs> well uh, I think it will be odd when, when we face each other in, in a different shirt after all this time and and well, I guess it will be as as normal as any other meeting. Just you know, good luck, fighting, all these things. Uh, but obviously, once you are in the pitch, there is <laughs> there is nothing we can do mm -hmm. to each other. But just be respectful, and after the game, shake hands, see you soon. Let's meet sometime for lunch, coffee, or if we have chance, and that's it. Okay. Not that I know. Not anything official, not that I know. People were saying, did you get, did you get this, this? <laughs> because the situation was that I didn't have, my, my contract here expired and everybody knew. And obviously after uh, Tian Su signed for Kanwon, yeah, people start calling me and texting me and telling, you know, like, yeah, now what, what now what? <laughs> But oh, nothing official that, uh, not that I know. I don't know the club or, or the agents, but they didn't get to me. If, okay. if it happened, it didn't get to me. <laughs> uh, well, I, I want to be careful on this one. <laughs> I still remember last year saying that we were going to fight for, you know, obviously this is what I want. But uh, looking back, I think we should learn from this and, you know, go step by step. Uh, we need to think game, game by game, winning first game, second game, third game. But obviously nobody wants to be in the position that we were last year. How high we can go, we will try to go as high as possible for sure. But after what happened last year or even last two years, uh, becoming a strong team, I don't know, it will it will be difficult. He will head coach will try hard and the players will try hard. But sometimes some uh, I think we have to shake off all the all the disappointment from these years, you know, and start from fresh start mm -hmm. and go slowly, one game, two games, three games. And let's see after one, two months, let's see where we are, let's see how how we can look up or <laughs> we can have to look down. We have to be patient with this. Well, to the fans, I'm so grateful. I, they are always there for me. Every time I post something or news come out or the club posts a picture, they are always hearts, nice words. So I, I just have to thank them for being there. Uh, that support helped, helped me a lot to stay here want to stay here, to fight for them, to show them all my best. Hopefully we can, myself and, and the team, we can show them better performances this year than, than in the past. Thank you. <laughs>